the Civic Garden Center has been in Cincinnati for over 70 years. About 31 years ago, we started the Community Gardens Program. Uh, so that's been our hallmark. We really felt that we needed to do something to make us a little more relevant to the next generation. So when we heard about green roofs, we were really inspired to um, put one on a roof. And once we came to that conclusion, we realized that there were many more things that we could demonstrate in a building like this as well. We probably got a little wild and crazy with our thinking, maybe got a little off track beyond the scope of the mission of the Civic Garden Center, and that's when Social Venture Partners came into our lives. Social Venture Partners is an organization that works in the, with the idea of engaged philanthropy, so that we can all do more than just write a check, that we are willing to give our time and our energy and our intellectual capital as well. And we wanted to get involved in projects that would genuinely improve the environment, not just now, but for the next 20, 30 plus years through education. I got an email from Social Venture Partners about this grant competition they were having. I was a little skeptical and hesitant because I didn't know what that level of involvement would look like. So I went ahead and I filled out the application and that was the first thing that hit me that this was going to be different. This is not something they had done before and it was really a very big step for them and we really saw as social venture partners that we would be able to help them make that step a lot more effectively. The Green Learning Station really, uh, we thought, provided the platform where we could really make a difference in teaching children and adults how to eat healthy food, grow their own food, and really be healthy, and the joy of being healthy. Well, initially we applied to social venture partners, frankly, for the money. <laughs> But really what we gained from working with Social Venture Partners was much more about the relationships that they brought to the table. First thing we needed to establish was mutual trust. And they recognized that we weren't going to be telling them what to do. We were just going to be offering them suggestions and asking them questions in order to hopefully help them become clearer about what they wanted to do. This was our first investee, so it was an exciting time for both Social Venture Partners um, and the Civic Garden Center, and we really saw it as being able to assist them at a particular point in time. When they came to us, they were getting ready to launch the project and really came to us and said, we are at a crucial point in our organization. We need assistance in terms of trying to develop this project, trying to frame out what it's gonna look like. So we, we assembled a SWAT team of people. We had a lot of support from our other SVP partners. And then we started a process, and it turned out that after doing some competitive analysis and other types of study, we found out that the strategic plan needed to be changed. So after our strategic plan and discussions, we were able to focus and align the efforts so that they would be consistent with the mission. Uh, whenever we were missing a skill set, which was frequently in this project, um, you know, we are not construction people, we, we don't know a lot about doing a project like this. The big part of the building the GLS was a huge construction project. And there really wasn't a lot of project management experience in the Garden Center, and I had managed projects for years uh, in business. So I came in and I brought in a project management methodology, I trained the appropriate people on project management, all the different forms and how to make sure things are kept on track. And then I stayed with them, uh, meeting with the project manager over time. station is a great addition to the Civic Garden Center campus because it really shows what you can do in a very urban setting to have a positive impact on the environment with whatever land you have. It's teaching homeowners, it's teaching children, it's teaching business people, and it's teaching our political leaders, our city leaders, what we can all do to make the environment here in Cincinnati better. 
The response has been very positive. Um, people are amazed at the ability to grow fruits and vegetables on a roof. And I think they understand the Civic Garden Center in a new way. I would tell anybody to jump all over it. Give it 100% to work with SVP because they are, the, the dollars pale in comparison to what they bring to the table in terms of intellectual capital and relationships. This was an incredibly successful partnership between SVP and the Civic Garden Center. I mean, they really helped to transform our organization. This partnership has made both of our organizations better organizations. And I, I'll also say, personally, speaking for me, after 30 years in business, I'm a better person for this. I know more, I understand more about the nonprofit community, and I think I'm a better businessman and a better person because of this relationship. Thank you.